All right, guys, and welcome back to The Witcher 3. We have just lost one of our own, our dearly beloved Vesemir. A fitting tribute to him on the edge of that cliff. As everyone stands around, we have got no choice but to move on. We have won the battle, but we have lost someone very special to us. Now we've got to go meet Avalak and find out what we can try to do about this. immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly to no effect. I'll gladly argue with you about this. So Avalak's a bit disappointed in us. Hmm. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Cyril from here, Haida, and then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses, arch mistresses of magic. You mean the lodge? That was a rather unfortunate camera angle there for Portress. <laughs> uh, okay, the lodge is in a shambles well. I don't want to involve the lodge. Doesn't look like we have a choice. Is probably right. I think the more the merrier. And we've got to give them a go. Don't trust the lodge one bit. But doesn't seem like we have a choice. Because we don't. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think! I've had enough of this! I won't be taken somewhere like a... bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding! Uh, well, she's not, got, she's not exactly wrong here, is she? Um, she has a very good point. This is all about and centred around her, yet we're just talking as if she's not even here. You are right, Siri. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Jirel possesses a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. <laughs> Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly and not through Geralt. I'm gone. I will go after her. Let's have a chat. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. Wow. Well, 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 well. Avalak, what an amazing looking elf he is. Fantastically unforgettable character. A few days later. <laughs> I wonder how you train somebody to control a power that nobody else has got. It's not working, don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. I'm not getting anywhere. We shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet either. Oh, Geralt, please, not now. By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalok says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Those are a few of Tell my favorite things. How do you do it? What? 
always manage to pull yourself together, focus, no matter what's happening. Uh, look, you don't have to be good at everything. Think I know what might lift your spirits. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? The Skellica druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! <laughs> Now that conversation choice I just made was an important one, and I'll tell you You'll why in a little while. Oh, we're actually doing this. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> Wimp. We'll see about that. <laughs> How do I pick Come up a? Uh, good shot. Defeat Siri in a snowball fight. Don't let the snowballs hit you. Now, how do I make a snowball? Oh, I've got them. Gotcha. Hey, that's cheating. How is it cheating? Oh, gotcha you again. Now. now, how do I pick up more? Oh, there we go. I see you. Come on, come on. Come at me. Come at me, bruh. Come at me, sis. Hey, Piece of cake. That's cheating. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done this option before, but I know why oh, I should do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh, I will thrash you. <laughs> oh, I've got to pick up some more. Where are you? Damn snowballs. I love this. Snowball fight with Siri. Um, there we go. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? You get her when she's kneeling down. It's, that seems to be the easy way of doing it. Come on then. Not happening. Okay, we lost the light. Oh, the Geralt, dude. Come on, are you gonna make it easy for me, Siri? Oh, I will thrash you. Job done. You probably get more XP right. for dodging. That really works. Thanks. Glad to be of service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. Saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to say I don't care. We have to care about Siri. This is important. And that's why I said earlier on that conversation option I chose. Uh, when I said, I know what I'll, I know what will lift your spirits. I know what might lift your spirits or whatever. The other option is actually uh, not a positive one. So there are a couple of conversation choices you need to make. And, and there's another one about to happen here. So, enlighten me. Who is this guest of honor? Don't know. Enlighten me. Imlarith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Ooh. Where'd you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. Do you know what you're doing? Uh, what does Avalak say? I don't suppose she cares what Avalak says, to be fair. So I'm not going to ask her that one. How'd you learn about the Sabbath? This is interesting. How did you learn about this? How do you learn all this? Imlarith, the Sabbath. Avalak, he told me of those who chase us. Claims knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come, we shall talk on the way. 
Uh, okay, here's, here, this is it. So pick this one. Valen, it is. Lead on. Even though we had the choice to say, right, we've got to talk to the Emperor first. No, that's a no. Ready? This, I'll tell you in a sec, sorry. Let's go. This is all about encouraging Ciri to find her own path. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. Oh, he has to. Yeah, and the reason why we're doing all this is because we want to get what I consider the best ending of the game. And what that will be, you'll see, but it starts with encouragement and backing her and supporting her and getting her to believe in herself. It's a true guide to parentalhood, this, this game. Wow, it's such a good shot. Beautiful. So we seek Rewenge. Revenge. Revenge. <laughs> Where was that from? Rewenge. Is it like a Princess Bride or something? The men at Crow's Perch, they spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the ladies of the wood. The peasants feared coming here, and the Baron thought the ladies of the wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the Baron is. Ah. Hanged himself after his wife died. Daughter's in Novigrad. A true shame. Very true. I, I did like the Baron. He was an amazing character. And, and there is a way to sort of stop him from hanging himself. And, and it's just, again, it's down to a few choices that you make. Okay, you actually know Imlarith will be there. How? Well, she kind of already said, but let's ask again. We stand to find Imlarith here? You sure? Avalok told me of beings who commune with the NL Elves. They can be found in every part of our world. In Velen, the Crones do this. Apparently, Imlarith came here at Eridin's behest, to order the Crones to keep their eyes open and ears pricked, in case Avalok were to seek shelter in his Velen hideout. Took the order literally judging by all the ears hanging in the woods. Think Imlarith might still be here? <laughs> he craves the pleasures of the flesh, wine, sex. The crones indulge him, flatter his ego. I'm certain he'd not let this opportunity pass, and will be on Bull Mountain for the Sabbath. And you know your way around, because I've got a, a mini-map that guides me. What about you, Siri? You actually know this area? Centuries ago, it was a hallowed site for druids. But then the crones arrived, destroyed the Velen Circle, and deformed the Sacred Oak atop the mountain. An important feast is observed here annually. The Sabbath, they call it. All the local folk attend. I suspect Imlarith attends too, as the crone's guest. Seem to know it well. Avalark's a good tutor. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. Oh, isn't this the great? The folk of Velen call this night the Feast of Gifts. I've no idea why. Okay, can we, can we speed it up a bit? Uh, okay, well, Roach, I did accidentally call Avalok Roach there, but that's not happening. Imlarith's greatest weakness. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthir, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalok's student. She's got a rather wide stride to her step walking there. Look at that. Look at this. Geralt's looks a little more natural. I wonder if they just animated the step walks afterwards. Nay. The white one once served the ladies. But he's an out An outsider. Approach. But they've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. All right, Gandalf. Fires down that away with food and drink plenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. Um, we'll sit down by a fire. Oh, that is actually the way to progress. Uh, but time we were on our way. All right, let's sit down. We thank you for the invitation. Be glad to sit down, right? Speak for yourself. Come with me. 
Unfortunately, it was the yellow conversation option, Siri. I had no choice. <laughs> he went the wrong way. <laughs> so what is this going to be? A tale of the Sabbath and the perversions that are, occur at the top of the mountain? Does it all trickle downhill? Is that why you sit down here? I don't know. What, you, what are you doing here? Uh, what does the feast celebrate? Yes, I actually want to know this. celebration, what's it about? What do you need to know, wanderer? No need for anger. The white ones serve the ladies as we do now. We send them gifts all year long. And on this night, they repay us with their blessing. I met one of your gifts to the crones. Snivelling, scared to death and about eight years old. Mm. Stay calm. These were the people that gave the children to the ladies of Crookbank Bog. The witches. To fatten them up. To use them. Oh my god, I didn't realize it was these people. So why do these ladies need your children? Your children? Why do the ladies need them? We know not and never ask. You don't know? Then let me tell you. Tell us instead what a peasant, his own young and starving, is to do with a wandering war orphan. You're not from here. Don't judge us by others' laws. I, I would like to say fair enough, but nope. The lady's blessing. What is this? What does it mean? Said the ladies bestow blessings on you. Aye, for our lives turn thus. First a summer of labor neath the hot sun, then autumn rains, then a winter of death. Then we await spring, when all that is dead is born anew. And from our blood and sweat, the oak bears acorns, at times few, at times a handful. What do you do with the acorns? The Velen elders gather, hold council. Some favor grinding them to spread on the fields for a rich harvest. Others want them given to a cunning woman who'd make medicine for consumption. A handful of enchanted acorns is enough for all Velen. Tis never enough. It's amazing, isn't it, how this has happened time and time again in history. It's like, if they don't pray hard enough, then to, to whoever gods or whoever it is they worship or bestow their gifts upon, then they'll be condemned to a, 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 a poor harvest that year. And if they get that poor harvest, in, because of natural conditions, in my opinion, they blame themselves. And they have to pray even damn harder the next year. And that year they might get a good harvest. So that now sets the bar for how hard they have to pray or donate or... Oh, just... Changing topics. Heard enough about this. We've got other questions. Uh, we should go. Oh, this gate, why can't we get past it? I don't really care. The ladies descend to you. What then? Oh, when they come down from this mountain, what happens then? Ladies of the wood visit you? If they favor us. My father told me they descended once. Passed from fire to fire, listening to hopes and grievances. So each year, we wait for them to walk amongst us once more. Haven't done it in a long time, then. No point waiting to see if we'll get lucky. Yeah, we gotta try to reach the peak. Oh, am I can am I, I just made a mistake earlier on when I said this was the ladies of the Crookback Bog, then, or the witches. Maybe, I, maybe I'm wrong about that. Is this the ladies of the wood, the ones who we met before the Morgvarg quest? Oh, it could be, actually. All right, I'll take it all back. Anyway, look, let's get out of here. We've got someone to going. revenge. Eager to see against. the ladies. I share your yearning. We're a fire with yearning. Come, Geralt. We must get there before daybreak. Go to the tent and stand before Thecla. She's the one who decides who's worthy to face the ladies. Already. Well, all right then. Let's get going. I wonder if I can just borrow a, a moment of this blacksmith's time before we go any further. I need some urgent repairs, and perhaps you've actually we'll got offering. Uh, Gwent cards or something like that. No, you've got nothing. Nothing I am interested in, but I could sell you this crap. Wild Hunt, Warrior's Sword. Look at that, 13,000 
coins now. I'm doing all right. I've got a load of cash in my pocket I don't need. The Mahakaman. Mahakaman steel sword. That's going to go. I like to keep the relics, uh, the relic weapons and go stick them in my stash. Uh, just to sort of get a little collection together. I don't, I don't really know why. I just like doing it. Uh, Alright, that's craft crafting. Oh, what am I at? Level 32. Oh, I wonder... I wonder, can we do this now? Let me let me just go minimize this. The silver sword. The uh oh. Oh, this guy can't craft them. He's not uh talented enough. What I really want to do is be able to craft the uh superior feline sword. I and this guy he's just not he's just not up to the job. Oh well, we'll just repair what we've what we've got on us, and actually we'll repair this guy as well. Uh, yeah, repair you because we might need it. Uh, the rest of this stuff's not really damaged enough because I haven't used it. Uh, seventy nine at one sixty. Yeah, that'll do. Let's go. So long. So long. Farewell. I'm leaving. You good night. I don't know where that came from. I do apologize. Oh, it's because I said earlier on these are a few of my favorite things. I've got the sound of music in my mind. No, a godling. I know him. Name's Johnny. Johnny. Well, old B, you're back. And I see you found your lass. I'm Johnny. We've had the pleasure already. A bit one-sided, though, it was. See, I saw you running. You're back to me, as I was <laughs> having the pleasure of. Oh, tis a long story. <laughs> they call me Siri. Nice to meet you. How are things, Johnny? Health's good, so no complaints. What brings you here? I do like Johnny. He's one of the lovely characters of the game. So, uh, why, if, rather than what brings us here, why are you here? What are you doing here? Last we met, you and the crones weren't exactly friends. I got an invitation I couldn't refuse, same as every year. In their peculiar way, the crones tolerate my presence and wish to see me at their Sabbath. Oh, I was right then. So I Here's the crones. wander about and go home with the rising sun. What about you? He's got, like, fish eyes, hasn't he? It's such a, a wonderfully crafted-looking character, creature, even. We need a way up. I can see the path. I don't know why we, we need to look for it. <laughs> we gotta climb the mountain. Can you help? I'd rather try to dissuade you, but I'm certain that would be in vain. The lass. She is stubborn as you. Even more so. Figured as much. Oh. Path to the peak starts there. Past the gate. But only old Thekla's got the key. So, since you shan't ever get it, you best turn back now. Uh, well, hang on a second. I'm a witcher. She's a child of the Elder Blood. Um, it's... It's a given. We're gonna get through the damn gate. I'll just ard it down if I have to. Why won't we get it, though? What's, what's the conditions? The key. Why do you doubt we can get it? Oh, good grief! You're worse than children! <laughs> Three souls are allowed atop the mountain. And only strapping young lads or comely lasses among them. They get the key, open the gate, and meet the ladies. I believe I qualify. But he's old and ugly. What good is he? How? Pretty damn good at finding lost voices. Damn. You go find the voice of reason. It'll tell you to turn back. There's no fooling with the ladies. Uh, do the crones have guests? I guess he's gonna say there's this big, tall, armor clad fella up there. We're here to find an elf named Imlarith. Siri thinks he might be a guest of the crones. Big bloke, in full play? There you go. Going the right way. He's atop the mountain, all right. You've seen him? Saw him in the bog first. Water froze beneath his horse's hooves. Then I saw him again yesterday, heading up this path. Why are you looking for him? He killed my friend. Our friend. Wouldn't seek revenge if I were you. Even the ladies bow and scrape before that one. Uh, try? I like this. We've got to try? There is no try. There is only do or do not. Gotta get to the summit. Simple as that. 
It's Thecla you'll need to convince. She's blind as your bum, but she won't be fooled. We shan't try to trick her. She sits in that tent over yonder. I wish you luck and do hope we meet again someday. I do too, Johnny. You are a lovely, Moons lovely person. Rising owls fires just hours okay, late. who is this Thecla? Sounds like the uh, the the creature it's from Stranger Things. Oh, that was Vecna. Welcome. <laughs> Are these all in a queue to talk to Thecla? Oh, no. I've got to get to the back of the queue. Oh no, here we go. None of you is worthy, she says. What about us? Mm, who's that? Well, come on, come closer, girl. Just don't touch the welts on her face. Aye. What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. <sighs> Never mind. Got me answer. <laughs> I choose you, girl. This night you shall see the ladies. Well, there you go, Siri. You're in. Uh, <laughs> I hate that. I thought she sniffed her to tell whether she'd ever been with him. I mean, I'm, oh, that's just... <laughs> Uh, uh, it's making me feel all icky. I, I'm going with her. Siri, what do you think? Let's ask Siri what she thinks. Siri. Wonderful. Who wouldn't want to meet the ladies? My companion comes with me. <laughs> what else has the cat drugged in? School of the this Cat Witcher. This grey and veiny got a scar and eyes like a viper. I <sighs> Stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus, it's old and infertile. My God. I reject ye, freak. The girl will ascend alone. I'm gonna run you through, woman. What the hell? How dare you? <laughs> I mean, Geralt is an absolute hunk of a man. <laughs> They'd be lucky to have him. <laughs> what is this all about? Okay, I've got to find out. This woman's amazing. What's this about? What have you chosen her for? Tell him. Each year, three chosen have the honor to meet the ladies. What happens after they've had this honor? When they return, they speak of the past no more. Joy rules them and they start life anew. The last were not the first to be chosen this day, but the moon hangs eyes, so she's like to be the last. Okay, um, I'm going with her, that's that, or appearances can be deceiving, I'm worthy. I don't, I don't know. I think we should just force our way through. I'm going with her. <laughs> <laughs> He's fire in his gut. What do you see? He's determined. He loves the girl, but he seeks to hide it from us. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. By ancient right, you may appeal my choice. But to do so, you must best the challenge. Oh, God. I'll take the challenge, whatever, because I'm not getting through there without it, right? I don't see how that these guys can stop me, anyway. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. Arm wrestle? Game of Gwent? Tiddlywinks. Who can hold your breath underwater without drowning the longest? That's what it is. I've basically got to jump in there, have I? Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse, so they call it the Defiers Oren. Now, bring me the coin. Why do I feel like this is just a distraction? Something's Do you mind coughing near me, please? I believe you're diseased nice. with something. So why do I... Oh, hang on, there's a book here. That might... Ilf... Ithlin's prophecy. Behold, for nigh is the time of the sword and axe, the age of the wolven blizzard. Nigh is the time. Oh, this is, this is the ancient prophecy. Okay, this is the world should perish amidst ice and be reborn with the new sun, reborn of the elder blood of Hennichair, of a planted seed, a seed that will not sprout but burst into flames. Estrathes. So so shall it be. I hope I said that right. So shall it be. Watch for the signs, and I say unto you what signs they shall be. First the earth will run with the blood of the Ainsaid, the blood of the elves. 
This is basically to do with Siri, sort of. Right, let's go. go on then, Swim. Jump. I thought I would do a more fashionable and cool looking dive. Now, where is ye? Oh, God, we got drowners. Okay, it's good. No, it's not good because I haven't got my crossbow armed. Uh. Right. There we go. Let's, let's, no, keep moving, Garrett, please. You're going to drown. Fires are now. Look, I can't pass up the opportunity to grab this loot quickly. Anything else? No. No, no, no. Just go, go, go. Come on, get out, get out, get out. Oh, come on, Geralt. Would you please swim a little quickly? All right, good night. All right, I got your damn coin. What the hell? Who? What? Where? Oh my god. Right. Are you ready? Come on in. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. This is the creature I've... Oh. Yep, got knocked over by. I killed one of these before. And I, as again, I, 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 I do like doing this, but look at the state of it. It is a beautiful creature. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful red mane. Antlers of an elk. Lion's tail. Oh, it's so good looking. And we're going to kill it. Stench. And not too difficult a beast to master either. Thank you. Now, back to the matter in hand. I fell down a long way, so it's a long climb back. You just get the feeling, though, while we were down there, they've done something. Oh no, Siri, she's alright. I was beginning to worry. I don't know, need Come, to worry. Let's get the key. You know who it is. Something's afoot. They're back. Something's... What do you want? Uh, well, I got it. Got that coin you tossed in the lake. It reeks of sludge. Well, you threw it there. Nothing I can do about that. So, gonna keep your word? I always do, my boy. Show the coin to the gatekeeper past the threshold. He'll know its meaning. Marika will open the gate for ye. Now go. Walk out the door. That went smoothly. Weren't the one to do the diving in that cave. Stop whining. You're a witcher. You've dived in murkier waters. Yeah, have to tell you about the time I hunted a Zugo. Okay. Oh, look at this. What? Are, what are you all circled in, in red? She who knows. What's that all about? Okay, it's a long, it's a long book. Uh, pause the screen, pause it again, and then you get to you get to know what that's about. I must need that for a quest or something. I'm sure I've got that book already. Anyway, come on, America. The chosen will now ascend the mount to the there to meet America. Yeehaw! Sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> Come on, we got we got to get this guy. She's not saying a damn word, so I'm gonna have to do all the talking. America, so what brings you to this place? Why is it you stop people from going up here? It's like a VIP guest list. She's the bouncer. Locked key required. Yep. Ooh, easy now. I didn't need a key, I just had to wait for her to open it. Alright, we're on our way. Nine. Wait, what? What? We got another trap. Another test. Mm. Oh. Wow. What's your name, girl? What's yours? Mm. Your name don't <gasps> matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? Wow. I do not remember him looking so amazing. 
Uh, I passed the trial. Here you go. Here's a, have a coin. The trial. Here's proof. Recognize it. The Defiers Oren. A death sentence. What? It's a trap. Okay. All right then, big boy. Well, thankfully, we've got Siri on our side. And she does not take prisoners. Mind you. He's a fire breather and I'm on fire. Well, as you said in one of the comments, it's traditional. And he's done. All right, so it was hardly the test what I was expecting. A bitch. We've no time to lose. I'll tend to Imlirith, you take the crones. Avalark said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlirith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. Lizard Spock. She's, oh, it is always best of three, yeah. Ah, okay. It's it's a tie. And it's a cider. Damn it! Two out of three! Geralt wins. Uh, fate has decided. Fate has decided. I like that. Uh, Imanurith is dangerous. I'll take care of him. Now, let's just go with the fate. There's no need to patronize. Out of the question. I'll climb the mountain. You face the crones. Hardly a challenge. They're extremely dangerous. Be careful. You too. So we're going to split our talents for different foes. This is so exciting. I must get down there. Bald Mountain. Oh, hell. I guess I must jump. Do it. Do it. Do it. Hardly a jump. More of a styled fall. But that's okay. What more could there possibly be to do? There's no treasure in here because this is Ciri's section and we don't carry it over to Geralt if we find something. At least I don't think you do. So I'm not going to bother looking. All right, Ciri. Oh. Uh-oh, I might have to blur some stuff out again. Oh, god damn it, it's gonna take ages editing. How was he? He lived a life of love and knew no bitterness. Oh my word, they eat the people they send up here. It's the witches in their more attractive forms. Yeah, nice. Element of surprise. Good job, Siri. Come to me, you little beauties. You've talked enough. Do it, Siri. Take him down. Okay. I don't know which one to go for, but I'm just going to keep on going because thankfully Siri's healing powers are second to none. Okay, let's just concentrate one at a time. Take down the big lass first, the Bruess. I have to be careful here. I am in a slight bit of trouble. That was a good shot. One down, two to go. Naughty girl, is that all you can say? I've been a bad girl for killing one of your sisters. I didn't wait long enough. Get out of here. We need to heal. 
Let it heal. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Just gonna let my health tick up a little bit. You die tonight. She's got a, a bit of a nip to her, that one. I keep on pulling this move. Might well pay off. Just keep the distance. Let the health come back. Okay, alright, I'll take it back. They've got the, the attacks of those water hags. Dodged that one. Naughty, naughty girl. Love that. Okay. That should have done her. Yep, she's done. We've got one left. She's chucking stuff at me. Naughty, naughty girl. God, this place is just filled with blood. Get her. Oh, it did, and off the down. Doing some damage to me, and I can't tell how she's doing it. Nice move. That's not so nice. Oh, God, move. Get out there. Get out of there. We've got to heal. Right. Just wait for the health to tick back up. A couple of hits, and we'd be done for. I mean, the fact those birds keep coming out, I feel like they're about to attack us, but they don't really do anything. Oh, that did. What do you think of that one? That's the blink skills. I haven't used that before with her. Let's try it again when we get it. Uh, let's go. I don't know what happened there. We just didn't zone in on her. Her disappearance. It was too powerful. Siri's strong attack is pretty damn mean and it's pretty damn fast as well. There you go. It's all over. Get the amulet? No way! Damn it! Okay, not good. W was that Vesemir's amulet? Imlareth's at the summit. Gotta be. Okay. So the Weavers, one of them got away. No idea which one. Oh, we got a place of power up here. We'll have to grab that before. Place of power. Towers. Should draw from it. What sign is this? And an ability point. Oh, it's Quen. That's actually a really good move. At this particular moment, we are going to need this. So yeah, I probably had to blur out some of that stuff just to make it uh, age-friendly. <laughs> and more coming. <laughs> thinking about leafing. <laughs> oh. The 
basic instinct moment there. The sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl. But she is with you, is she not? <sighs> what do I say? Yes, she's here or I came alone. I don't really care. It don't matter. You're going to die now anyway. Yeah, we're both here. Where is the girl? Doesn't matter. You'll never get her. You fought bravely in the ruin, to the bitter end. I trust this time will be no different. Oh, bring it on, baby. I shouldn't be so cocky. Okay, that shield's gonna protect him a fair amount. Let me quen up. All right, first blood to me. I don't know if that actually took. I think I must have just caught his shield at the wrong time there. Okay, he beat my uh, my quen, but thankfully I can stick it back on, mate. Almost worth letting him have that little surprise attack. That might be the way to go. Wait for him to turn his back on us. Keep the coin coming. Ah, there he goes. He's got a good hit in there. Back with the coin. Oh, yeah. You, oh, you messed up now. Ah, no, you didn't. I did. <laughs> Too easy, man. Too easy. Come on. Come on, do something. Do something. Oh, I could have sworn that would have burned. All right. Decides to drop the shield. And make, try and surprise me. Oh, you did surprise me. Good job. Whoa, whoa. Ouch. Get out of here, Geralt. He's he's on a rampage. We'd have to just avoid these shock attacks or surprise attacks. If it's at all possible. Wait for him to do that one. And he kind of gets stuck on the ground. Oh, no, that one failed. Oh, thank you, Quinn. Oh, it's just all over. Check that out. What a shot. Who told you to fight like this? The Witcher you slew. Oh, God. That must sting a little bit. It's like Red Skull. Oh, do it. Do it. Do it. It was a very, very easy fight, but of course, after the leveling up I've done at uh, this level of difficulty of the game, it, it really is just uh, a, a very short fight. It's almost like story mode. We did it. Barely. How'd it go down there? I slew only two of the crones. The third fled with Vesemir's medallion, my sole memento. Don't worry. We'll get it. 
You avenged Vesemir? No, not yet. I think we need that third crone. Even though Imlareth is dead. We were lucky, very lucky. No, I don't think so. It's fate, Geralt, it's fate. Good idea to come here, absolutely. Coming here? Good idea. I knew we'd succeed. From the start. Now to find Eredin and kill him. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses at the lodge. We ought to rejoin them. The sorceress of the lodge. Should we go or shouldn't we? Well, we do need to get there. Um, but do we do it right now? Or do we do it later? It doesn't really matter. Um, but let's go now. Why not? Yeah, let's get going. Thank you for coming with me. Come here. Let's go. The oak is dead. The oak, the crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns? I'll chop them off, to be fair, mate. I don't really care. <laughs> I don't think you need them to live I don't know if I should say you'll need to live without them because they will anyway um there you go don't know don't care you must learn to live without them this is no longer no man's land it's no longer the lady's land it's all yours but this is your what land. are we to do come Geralt it's time manage on your own Well, I wonder if we can go back up there. I mean, Imlareth must have had some loot on him. I mean, <laughs> surely. A couple of chicken sandwiches, maybe, in his back pocket? I would have thought so. Then non-humans it was mages the hunters and the temple guard were after mages left hunters needed a new quarry god is dread and prejudice still burning will be eradicated and witch hunts will never be about witches to have a scapegoat that's the key humans always fear the alien the odd once the mages had left novigrad Folk turned their anger against the other races, and as they have for ages, branded their neighbors their greatest foes. Dundee Lion! Ready some tankards! With guests! Geralt! Siri! When I learned Geralt had found you. Glad to see you in one piece too, Dandelion. Where have you two been? Hmm. Uh, Imlareth, we got him. Yeah, why not? Why wouldn't we share that with our friends? No, it's Dandelion. I know he's not a fighter, but he could have he could have turned up at Kaer Morin for moral support, couldn't he? No, I'm, jo I'm joking. He's just we, he would have been no use. Just a purple distraction in the background. Just finished hunting down the crones of Velen and a general of the Wild Hunt. Well, you would have busy more then, haven't you? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Gladly take some. Point me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, girls. 
I've a little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up, then await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. The sorceresses. Yes, now that is the whole point, right? We, we've got to try and gain their support, garner their support. Uh, anything interesting happen? Whoa. Um, not quite sure what you mean by that, but let's ask away. Anything happened while we were away? Uh, Pretty Polly came down with a fever, Matt Oyster caught a knife between the ribs, and they're late delivering the sodden triple meat. Dandelion. <laughs> Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs, waiting for you. Yennefer's gone to crippled Kate's. Yen? At that portside dive? Why? Didn't inform me. Imagine that. Ah, and that elf of yours moved into the ruby suite. Told me to tell you he's waiting too. You gave him the best room. I think he took it, actually, from the, from the tone of Dandelion's voice. Uh, Avalak didn't just uh, book it or pay for it. I think he just moved himself in. Gave him your best room? He didn't exactly ask. Exactly. There you go. I prepared another room for him, but he blew past me and locked himself in the ruby. Hasn't peeked out since. Barely eats, drinks only water, and the only thing I've heard from him is, I wish to know when Gwynblade and Zeriel arrive. Thanks. Looks like I'll have my hands full. And there it is, guys. That's the end of this episode. We start a new quest, Final Preparations. However... I have got a lot of little sidey things I want to pick up. This is not like by any means the end of the story, but it's kind of getting there, right? We're on the final path. We're in, in like the final uh, chapter of this game. Now, I want to go out there and do a few things. I will record a couple of them and I'll, I'll put them in the next episode. But for now, this episode is over. Thank you so much for watching absolutely loved the revenge that we got and uh, it was nice to see those three witches once more in, in spite of their hideous appearances. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. All the best. Take care and good night.